Ricardo. Good morning, friends, and welcome to The Bright Side, your nutritional program dedicated to the understanding of the vast world of nutrition and nutritional supplementation. I am your host, Pharmacist Ben, nutritional pharmacist from Boulder, Colorado. I specialize in using nutritional supplements where other healthcare practitioners use toxic pharmaceutical drugs and deadly medical procedures. If you suspect that there are natural nutritional roads to your vitality, to your health, to your well-being, and to addressing your health challenges, whatever they may be, but you don't know where to begin, you have come to the right place. As you listen to The Bright Side every day, you are more and more knowledgeable, you are more and more in control of your body, and you know you can overcome any health issue. That is why we are here every day on The Bright Side, helping clear up the sometimes confusing world of nutrition and nutritional supplementation. Over the last 27 years of practicing pharmacy, I've seen drug-free recoveries from diabetes and hypertension, obesity, skin diseases like acne, psoriasis, eczema, rosacea, digestive ailments, autoimmune issues of all kinds, recoveries that by the standards of modern medicine can only be called a miracle, but what is in the world of the body, what is in the world of biology, standard operating procedure, because the human biological system is a healing system, a regenerating system. It is designed divinely to heal and renew itself on a moment-to-moment basis. And while some folks may call that a miracle, it really is no miracle at all. It is just the way the body works. If you have questions about health or nutrition or prescription drugs, we are here for you. We welcome your phone calls on the bright side. Our number is 855-660-4261. If you have a success story you'd like to share, if you want to contribute to the conversation, if you have questions about the longevity products, if you want to help a loved one get off their medications and get on a good nutritional supplement program, we welcome your calls, 855-660-4261. If you want to learn more about the longevity products, you can call the Brightside Ben phone team at 866-735-2470. That's 866-735-2470. Or you can head over to my website, brightsideben.com, take a look at our shopping cart, with all the longevity products, including my personal favorite longevity product, the Beyond Tangy Tangerine Multivitamin Mineral Complex Powder. You add it to water and drink. It tastes great. It's a wonderful way to get your fat-soluble vitamins. They're typically hard to absorb and hard to utilize, vitamins A, D, E, and K. It's got the B complex. It's got vitamin C in it, chondroitin, MSM, glucosamine. Most folks will notice results in one or two doses. If you haven't tried this stuff yet, give it a shot. It's just 50 bucks a canister from the moment you even think about it. Getting on a nutritional supplement program, your life will begin to change. Just thinking about getting on a supplement program. But once you get on a supplement program, once you try products like the Beyond Tangy Tangerine or any of the longevity products that you can find out, find out all about on brightsideben.com, you will notice that you're feeling better. You will notice your blood pressure is dropping. You'll notice you're losing weight. And it's simply because the body runs on this stuff, folks. This isn't miracle. This isn't drugs. This isn't anything less than common sense. Your body runs on nutrition like a car runs on gasoline. And you can't have a healthy body without nutrients any more than you can have a healthy car or a a well-running automobile without gasoline. That's the way you want to think of nutrition and nutritional supplementation. Beyond Tangy Tangerine, you find out all about it at brightsideben.com, or you can call the Brightside Ben phone team at 866-735-2470. You can also check out my blog, pharmacistben.com. Got a new post up there. I'll have a couple more posts hopefully before the end of the week. We update it regularly, and I encourage you to sign up for my newsletter, which hopefully will be out here in the next couple of months. All right, thanks so much for joining us on the Bright Side. Once again, I want to finish up, tie up a loose, few loose ends about vitamin K uh, today, and then we'll take a letter in the next segment. And uh, got a nice letter on eczema I thought was kind of interesting, and I'll work through this for, uh, for Danielle, who wrote to me about eczema. So we'll tie up a few loose ends on vitamin K, and then tomorrow we'll talk about how you can get more vitamin K into your body. And then we'll talk about our next bone-building nutrient, which, as I've said many times, is not just a bone-building nutrient. We've been talking about bone-building here for a couple of months, but it's really not just about bone-building. So don't think if you're not dealing with osteoporosis that this is not relevant to you, because bone-building is body-building. And when we're sick, when we're dealing with some kind of degenerative health crisis, what we want to think about to reverse that is bodybuilding, whether it's bone building or, or, or circulatory system building or brain building. It's all bodybuilding and vitamin K and phosphorus and sulfur and vitamin A and vitamin D and all the nutrients we've been talking about 
all are relevant for building a healthy body. And vitamin K is a classic example. Vitamin K is super misunderstood. Nobody, your doctor probably doesn't know about vitamin K and the importance of vitamin K for, for the heart, the importance of vitamin K for fighting cancer, the importance of vitamin K for neural conduction. Everybody knows or most people know, most healthcare professionals anyway, know about vitamin K as an anticoagulation vitamin, but vitamin K is so much more than that. Last, last uh, program, or uh, I think it was the day before yesterday, we talked about how important vitamin K was for reducing cholesterol plaques, improving cardiovascular function. In my humble opinion, or not humble opinion, Vitamin K, uh, uh, this role for vitamin K for improving cardiovascular function, improving cholesterol plaques is, if not the most underappreciated aspect of vitamin K chemistry, it's right up there. Vitamin K, as we talked about, allows the body, allows molecules to create, uh, to create hooks. Proteins have a structure, all chemicals have a structure, and proteins can, can actually have a little hook-like element on them, and this little hook-like element traps calcium and allows these, these little molecules to trap calcium and clear calcium out of the blood. Vitamin K is involved in allowing these proteins to make hooks. Vitamin K allows protein or helps protein make hooks so they can trap calcium to mop calcium out of the blood. This mopping up effect prevents one of the most important causes of heart disease, which is calcification. Calcification is the buildup of calcium in the blood. Calcium that builds up in the blood can become attracted to the blood vessel walls, and this is how plaques can form. Vitamin K, by allowing these proteins to create hooks on themselves, can help, help these proteins clear calcium out of the blood, preventing calcification. A lack of vitamin K is associated with calcification, and calcification is a leading cause of cholesterol plaques and heart disease in general. And it's not just the heart. All soft tissue can calcify, and all soft tissue calcification can be improved or prevented by getting enough vitamin K. So now we know vitamin K is a clotting vitamin. We know vitamin K is a nerve cell vitamin. We know vitamin K is a cardiovascular vitamin. We know vitamin K is an anti-cancer vitamin. But guess what? Vitamin K may also involve, may also uh, help improve brain health. It also may help improve muscle and nerve health. This is all based on recent research. And if you understand the basic mechanism of vitamin K, this should come as no surprise. Nerve cells run on calcium the same way any other cells do, maybe even more so. And vitamin K, by its ability to help these proteins make hooks, allows calcium transport and calcium metabolism to proceed as it should. Calcium metabolism is extra important for nerve cells. So it makes sense that vitamin K, which is one of, if not the premier calcium-regulating vitamin in the body, would have a major effect on improving neural conduction, brain cell conduction, nerve cell conduction. If you're dealing with Parkinson's disease or dementias of any kind or movement disorders, you would be well advised to make sure you're getting 5,000 MCG, 5,000 micrograms or so of vitamin K daily into your supplement program. Keep in mind, vitamin K is not very well respected or very well known, so you're not going to find a heck of a lot of vitamin K in most multivitamin supplements. So you've got to get extra vitamin K into your system, especially if you're dealing with any calcification issues or any neural conduction or brain health issues. We'll talk tomorrow about the different forms of vitamin K and the food sources of vitamin K, but for now I just want... I want you guys to understand that if you have any kind of brain health issues, neural conduction issues, movement disorders, dementias, think about supplementing with vitamin K. 5,000 micrograms a day is a good place to be. All right, so calcification can, uh, calcification can be thought of as, in essence, a type of bone formation, and that means that cal- uh, vitamin K has a very important role to play in bone health as well as preventing calcification. By the way, if you have kidney problems or you're on dialysis, your risk for calcification go up. Same with diabetics. Diabetics are at high risk for kidney stones, high risk for problems with calcium metabolism. As we'll find out later when we talk about the absorption of vitamin K, if you have a liver problem, if you have a gallbladder problem, if you had your gallbladder removed, or if you have any digestive health issues, you are at further risk for nutrient deficiencies and especially for calcification. My opinion, if you're dealing with calcification issues secondary to gallbladder problems, one of the best things you could do is get some chelation therapy. 
Chelation therapy is viewed by the medical community as some kind of quackery, but there's a lot of benefits to chelation, especially when it comes to calcification. Hang tight. We'll talk about this when we come back from our break. I'm Pharmacist Ben. You are listening to The Bright Side on the Genesis Communication Network, our number 855-660-4261. We're coming back at you right after this. Many Americans suffer from poor digestion, which can adversely affect their health. For you guys who have digestive issues, glutathione is amazingly important for inflammatory bowel disease, ulcerative colitis, Crohn's disease, stomach cancer. The glands of the stomach produce lots of glutathione. So glutathione's got multiple roles to play, and one of the best ways to upregulate to make more glutathione is to take the building blocks, glycine being one of the most important of the building blocks for making glutathione. Your ultimate enzymes contain something called trimethylglycine. We know it as betaine. We talk about betaine as an important ingredient for acidification, for keeping the pH of the stomach nice and low. But betaine can also help you make glutathione. Help your body build glutathione. Order Ultimate Enzymes by calling 866-735-2470. That's 866-735-2470. Or on the web at brightsideben.com. That's brightsideben.com. Order today. Have you ever felt like the United States government knows way too much about your financial affairs? I continue to hear stories about property seizures, frozen bank accounts, confiscation of stocks and bonds. It makes me wonder if the U.S. citizen will ever again have the right to life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. Unfortunately, with the Drug and Money Laundering Act, the IRS Revenue Ruling 6045 of 1984, and the Trading with the Enemy Act and Franklin D. Roosevelt's Executive Order of 1933, some precious metal holdings are subject to government intervention. For this reason, Midas Resources has prepared a report explaining the boundaries of trading precious metals privately. Whether if you have any intention of trading with Midas Resources or not, I have instructed my representatives to give this report out free. Call for your free copy at 1-800-686-2237. When investing, always proceed with caution. Again, call 1-800-686-2237. Exercise your legal right to trade metals privately. 1-800-686-2237. September is National Preparedness Month in the U.S., and it's National Savings Month at Freeze Dry Guy. Are you prepared to save? All Mountain House freeze-dried foods in number 10 cans are now 40% off at freezedryguide.com. These long-lasting foods for emergency preparedness with a guaranteed 25-year shelf life are 40% off at freezedryguide.com. These easy foods for camping, backpacking, hunting, and sailing are 40% off at freezedryguide.com. These delicious foods, freeze-dried to lock in the taste, aroma, and freshness, are 40% off at freeze Guide.com. All cans of Mountain House freeze-dried meats, entrees, fruits, and veggies are 40% off at freezedryguide.com. Be prepared and save 40% now through September 30th at freezedryguide.com or call 866-404-3663, 866-404-FOOD. With the well-known shortage of availability in guns and ammo, the question is, will food and preparedness items be next now? At ProStoresDirect.com, buy a 32-serving bug-out bucket, and you'll get a prime assortment of Mountain House survival food entrees, including favorites like chili mac with beef and spaghetti and meat sauce, all made with real USDA meat. That's enough food for one adult for a full week, all for just $75.99 with free shipping, delivered in a handy resealable bucket that'll store for up to 25 years. Pro Stores Direct has a huge selection of family-sized food units, too, right up to military-grade number 10 cans. And we'll give you great deals on new military first aid and surgical kits, portable water filters, heirloom seeds, and all your bug-out gear, always with free shipping to the lower 48. Be ready for any challenge with food security for your family at ProStoresDirect.com. ProStoresDirect.com, your first stop for preparedness and survival gear and proud sponsor of the free media. Are you tired of searching for great talk radio? Something more important. Search no more. We are the GCN Radio Network. All right, welcome back to the Bright Side. I am Pharmacist Ben, or number 855-660-4261. A couple more things here that I just want to say about the... Actually, let's talk about chelation therapy real quick, and then I'm going to take this letter on eczema and work through it for you guys so you can see how you can deal with... uh, 
with health challenges. Eczema is super easy to deal with. Nobody has to suffer with this thing. I'll talk about this here in a second. If you're dealing with calcification issues, if you've got a history of stones, if you have any kind of uh, problems with, with cardiovascular health issues, the formation of plaques, you want to think about chelation therapy, which for a long time, Still, it actually is viewed by the medical model as being kind of quackery. These days, it's becoming more recognized, fortunately. For many years, chelation, was, uh, for many years, chelation has been used uh, for heavy metal toxicity. But still, the official medical position is that chelation therapy is unproven. It's unsound. Uh, on the website QuackWatch, they actually call it unproven and unsound therapy. Now, I wouldn't regard chelation as a cure for heart disease. If you're dealing with calcification issues, there are things you need to be doing, correcting digestive issues, using vitamin K, using vitamin C, using magnesium and selenium. All of these can protect against calcification. Even deep breathing techniques can have an anti-calcification effect. There's a very important relationship between blood pH and calcium. And all of these strategies, nutritional supplementation, uh, deep breathing techniques, making sure your blood is not acidic. All of these can have very beneficial effects for calcification, but certainly chelation therapy is something that you may want to think about if you're dealing with cholesterol plaques or if you've uh, suffered a prior heart attack. Uh, chelation therapy usually involves a chemical called EDTA. Some of you may have heard of EDTA. EDTA can be used intravenously. You can uh, not use intravenously, but you can have a procedure done where you can have EDTA done, uh, EDTA put into your blood. Although you can also do EDTA chelation therapy orally. I'm not sure how well that works. Personally, if I was doing EDTA therapy, I would have a physician do it intravenously. You have to be a little bit careful with EDTA chelation orally because it may affect how you absorb nutrients. Now, I've never seen any studies that show this, but it just kind of makes biochemical sense. So if you're dealing with any kind of calcification issues, if your doctor told you about calcification, uh, that you're, uh, you, you're at risk for calcification, if you've had a prior history of heart disease, kidney stones, you may want to think about getting somebody to do some chelation therapy for you. Most naturopaths or physicians, well, most naturopaths anyway, can tell you about that. One last thing I want to tell you about vitamin K, and that involves the skin. Vitamin K, because of its ability to protect against calcification, can keep connective tissue proteins like collagen and elastin, which help keep your skin youthful and flexible and wrinkle-free. Uh, vitamin K can help keep these connective tissue proteins from calcifying. That means less wrinkles and less aging skin. And you can probably expect to see vitamin K containing skin creams out there on the market in the, in the near future to exploit these anti-calcification benefits. Now, whether or not you're going to get any topical anti-wrinkle effect by using vitamin K on top of your skin, uh, I'm not so sure about that. But personally, uh, I would be using vitamin K 5,000 micrograms a day if uh, if I wanted to prevent or if I was concerned about wrinkles or flexibility, skin flexibility as as I got older. All right, so gosh, how much how much how many benefits do you need from one nutritional supplement? Oh, by the way, vitamin K topically can protect against bruising, especially pre-surgical or especially post-surgical bruising. If you use vitamin K cream, a five percent vitamin K cream, and you'll have to have a compounding pharmacist make that for you before you go into surgery maybe a week or two weeks before you go into surgery. Uh, and then if you use vitamin K on top of the cut or the wound after surgery, you'll notice dramatically less bruising, and you'll notice, because you'll have dramatically less bruising, that you're healing much quicker. So you can use vitamin K cream topically to... You can actually put vitamin K cream right on a bruise. If you fall and you hurt yourself, you put vitamin K, uh, vitamin K cream on the bruise. You can pretty dramatically improve your rate of healing, how fast your body heals from the bruise. Older folks are notorious for bruising readily, and I would venture a guess that it has a lot to do with vitamin K deficiency. Remember, vitamin K is made by bacteria in the gut. We'll be talking about this tomorrow. So if you're bruising regularly or your your mom or your grandma or grandpa is bruising regularly, chances are they have some kind of issue with vitamin K, either deficiencies in vitamin K or problems with gut bacteria making vitamin K. Okay, let's take this letter here from uh, Danielle who writes, uh, that she has been dealing with eczema. She says she suffered from eczema since the age of two. She's now 39 years old. She says it gets better and then it gets worse. Uh, lately, she's getting breakouts on her face, and uh, she's taking Advair for her asthma. She says, I know my diet's not good. My diet can probably be labeled as carbohydrate-based, and I have a sweet tooth. Well, Danielle just answered her own question right there. Doctors want to give her one of the worst drugs in the history of the 
of all of pharmacy, and that's something called methotrexate. Methotrexate is a chemotherapy drug. It kills things. That's what chemotherapy does, by the way. It kills things. Chemotherapy kills cancer cells, but it kills all cells. So let's talk a little bit here about methotrexate, and then we'll talk about how you deal with eczema. Methotrexate is a chemotherapy drug. The doctor logic of using methotrexate to take care of eczema is that it suppresses immune system activity. It kills immune system cells. That's why they use methotrexate. So what does that tell you? Folks, if somebody, if a medical professional is dispensing or writing a prescription for a drug that suppresses the immune system, what does that tell us? Just common sense. It tells us that obviously there's immune system involvement. If you take a drug or you're recommended or prescribed a drug that suppresses the immune system, like a steroid drug or like methotrexate, that tells you just common sense. Just use common sense here. That tells you that the strategy is to suppress the immune system because we've got immune overactivity. Well, I'm here to tell you that if you have immune, uh, immune activity, an overactive immune system, and it's causing eczema or it's causing an autoimmune disease or it's causing any kind of immune problem, the appropriate response is not to knock out the immune system. It's to figure out why is the immune system active. Now, clearly this gal has an immune system problem because she's, on, she's got asthma, which is another classic immune system health issue. Now, she says her diet isn't good. Well, if you have a defensive response in the body, which is what an immune system response is, that means your body's defending itself against something. It isn't defending itself against pixie dust from a fairy that's dropping it on your head. It's defending itself from something you're putting in your body, something you're either breathing in your body, something that's getting into your body through the skin, or more than likely something you're eating. So Danielle has answered her own question. She says her, her diet isn't good. So what do you do? Well, first of all, you don't have to have zero tolerance for any kind of food that you like. you got to have zero tolerance for foods that you're reacting to. If you're reacting to a food, your body is telling you it doesn't want that food. It's as simple as that. And I don't mean to be a food Nazi here, but if we have a health condition, we're paying the price for our choices. So you got to link your digest, your uh, your uh, bodily symptoms. If it's eczema, you got to link your rashes. You got to link the irritation. You got to link the itchiness. You got to link all the symptoms of eczema to specific foods. It's as simple as that. For a doctor to prescribe a deadly toxic drug like methotrexate before he tells his patient that the symptoms are related to something that they're doing is just ridiculous. It's not nice. It's twisted. Physicians, medical professionals, you guys, you have to recognize that the immune system is the body's way of protecting itself. We never want to suppress this. We never want to suppress these protective mechanisms. We want to figure out why the immune system is hyperactive. And that means linking it to symptomology, linking immune activity and immune symptomology to specific things we're doing, especially foods. And then, of course, there's wonderful nutritional supplements we can use to patch up the digestive system. Hang tight. I'll finish this up when we come back from a break, and then we'll take your phone calls. 855-660-4261. Folks, health is easy. It's our birthright to be healthy. It's our God-given right to be healthy. Hi there. My name is Frank Bates. What I'm about to tell you in the next 60 seconds could get me in a lot of trouble. I just created a free video presentation at 123coverup.com that exposes the electricity monopolies and government agencies for what they really are, incompetent, lying crooks that are counting on your ignorance and fear to keep your power bills criminally high. Some have called this a conspiracy. Others have called it a cover-up, and you will be shocked to find out how deep the conspiracy goes. My video at 123coverup.com exposes the truth and shows you the secret of how I beat them and how you can beat them, too. Watch the controversial video that thousands of other smart patriots have already seen in the last three months. Go to 123coverup.com and discover one weird trick to slash your power bill and protect your home. Go watch my video now at 123coverup.com before they force me to shut it down. Again, that's 123coverup.com. We live in a complicated society. Stressful issues are always popping up. Have you ever been treated unfairly by someone? Have you ever been overcharged for a repair? Have you ever signed a contract or a document worried about identity theft? How many times have you been in those unique situations where you just wanted to call an attorney to find out if you're right or wrong or what your legal rights are? 
But every time you think about calling an attorney, what do you think about first? That's right. Who do you call and how much will it cost? Our friends at Legal Shield have found a solution. With a nationwide network of 6,900 attorneys who average 19 years of experience, Legal Shield's law firms take over 40,000 calls per week helping their members. For less than $20 per month, you can have access to Legal Shield on everything from the trivial to the traumatic. Let Legal Shield stand up for your rights at lsprotection.com. That's lsprotection.com. Or call 855-340-SAVE, 855-340-7283. An e-cig revolution is sweeping across the country. But is yours American-made? Vapriate e-liquid by LaSig is. Manufactured in Arkansas with 100% USA-sourced ingredients. And when you buy American, you support local jobs. Vapriate e-liquid by LaSig is top quality at an affordable price. The very principle that once drove the American economy. Get great taste with no ash, tar, or smoke. You'll be wondering why you didn't make the change to Vapriate e-liquid by LaSig a long time ago. LaSig.com has has everything you need for beginners to the advanced vaping enthusiast with a wide variety of hardware and also imported e-liquid flavors as well. Plus, Lasig smokes the competition with fast, free, same-day shipping, real people customer service, and a 30-day satisfaction guarantee. Support our country and become a vapriate at Lasig.com or call 870-525-1440. 870-525-1440. Lasig e-cigarettes for today's modern smoker. It's time to get healthy, and your first step towards a healthy lifestyle begins at the Healthy Living Expo, Saturday and Sunday, September 28th and 29th at the Music City Center in Nashville. Get your free tickets at thehealthylivingexpo.com and join us for Tennessee's most comprehensive health, fitness, and nutrition expo. There's over 100 exhibits with information and services to help create a healthier life. Also, more than 25 health screenings, cooking demos, and the latest fitness trends. Plus, visit the Young Longevity booth. Get free tickets at thehealthylivingexpo.com. There's prizes all day on the stages and at the booths, like fitness memberships to an area health club every hour. The Healthy Living Expo, September 28th and 29th at the Music City Center, Nashville. Get free tickets for yourself, your family, your friends, and everyone you know at thehealthylivingexpo.com. Get to the website now because tickets are $10 at the door. The Healthy Living Expo, your first step towards a healthy lifestyle. You've thought about it for years. Well, the time is now. You need a secret bunker, and you need it deep and strong. Atlas Survival Shelters should be your first and only choice. The experts at Atlas can help you choose a shelter that has all the comforts of your home and is 11 times stronger than square box shelters. Call Atlas at 1-855-4-BUNKERS. 1-855-4-BUNKERS. Or visit IWantThatBunker.com. Atlas Survival Shelters. Better prepared than scared. What if you had a witness everywhere you drive? Now you can with VideoDashCam.com. From truckers to motorcyclists, the handy Video Dash Cam can be used for insurance claims, accidents, police encounters, road rage, or natural disasters. Has instant screen playback and optional night vision. Get the best quality, affordable HD Dash cameras available at VideoDashCam.com. That's VideoDashCam.com. Or call 855-855-2022. Always have a witness with Video Dash Cam. The GCN Radio Network, providing the world with hard-hitting talk radio. GCN. Great talk radio starts here. Welcome back to the Great Side. 855-660-4261 is our number. Got a couple lines open for you. You guys got to call in earlier uh, so we can get to as many calls as possible. We'll get to your calls here in just a second here. Uh, eczema, if you're dealing with eczema, really if you're dealing with any skin issue, there's an important relationship between the skin and the digestive system. And I've been doing skin care now since 1983. All right, that's a long time to be working with skin care and formulating skin care products. Some of you know that I've been designing uh, high-end skin care products for myself and for other folks for, for many years, and I've been going out talking to people about their skin. And if I've learned anything, and I've learned a lot about the skin, but if I've learned anything... It's the important and critical link between the digestive system and the skin. They're both basically the same kind of tissue. Your skin is like your digestive system inside out. Your digestive system is your skin outside in. And rest assured, if you're dealing with eczema on the outside, you're dealing with some kind of digestive health condition on the inside as well. What the heck was that? 
got some kind of weird noise here in my headphones. Anyway, so if you have acne, rosacea, psoriasis, eczema, especially eczema, you want to focus first and foremost on digestive system health. That means eliminating problem foods, which is probably the single most important health strategy you could ever, ever do, eliminating problem foods, and then it means patching up the digestive system. Patching up the digestive system largely means coating the digestive system and encouraging healing of the digestive tract, and there's a lot of ways to do it. First of all, use coating soothing polysaccharides, that is protein, uh, long chain sugars and protein sugar complexes. Protein sugar complexes go by the name proteo for protein, glycans for sugar, proteoglycans, polysaccharides mean long chain sugars. Any, any kind of supplements or food sources that provide these are going to be wonderfully soothing for the digestive tract and they will improve eczema as well as other skin care, uh, the symptoms of eczema as well as, well as other skin care conditions, skin uh, health conditions. So long chain sugars, proteoglycans, you'll find them in aloe, you'll find them in noni, you'll find them in uh, products like the Z radical from Longevity, you can use glucosamine. Uh, you can use bone soup. In fact, bone soup is one of the best ways to coat and soothe the digestive system. You can also use a nutrient called glutamine. Now, I've been talking about glutamine for many years. You guys have probably heard me say use a teaspoon of glutamine powder, put it in water. Glutamine functions as fuel for the cells of the digestive tract for so-called enterocytes. Enterocytes are cells that line the intestine. Enterocytes are responsible for nutrient absorption. When your enterocytes become defective, Things can leak into the blood inappropriately. When things leak into the blood inappropriately, big trouble results. This is how, this is how we get immune system diseases. And autoimmunity is a big problem, by the way. Autoimmunity is a classic immune system disease. I wrote a post on multiple sclerosis here. Uh, I wrote it on Facebook, I think. I'm going to put it on my blog here in a couple of days. And I got all kinds of letters about people wanting help with multiple sclerosis. This is a horrible disease, but it's not really any different from any other autoimmune disease. Multiple sclerosis, muscular dystrophy, myasthenia gravis, asthma, eczema, these are all manifestations of a hyperactive immune system. And people, it is so simple. It is so simple. It's tragic to reverse these things. If your doctor has put you on an immune system drug or an anti-immune system drug like methotrexate or a steroid, he is telling you in his own way, he doesn't know he's telling you this, that your immune system is hyperactive. And if that happens, focus on digestive health and digestive wellness by using things like uh, uh, the Z-Radical product, by using aloe juice, by using noni juice, by using glucosamine, by using proteoglycans, by using polysaccharides, by... Hyaluronic acid, by the way, is another incredibly important supplement for the digestive tract. That is a, 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 a proteoglycan-like substance. And then glutamine powder, which is fuel for the enterocytes, fuel for your intestinal cells. Zinc is very, very important for the digestive system. There's actually a supplement you can get called zinc carnosine. C-A-R-N-O-S-I-N. Zinc carnosine can be very helpful for digestive health issues. Digestive enzymes are incredibly important. The ultimate enzymes from longevity can help you not only process food, but the ultimate enzymes from longevity, all digestive enzymes, can help with inflammation as well. Here's, the, here, here's something very interesting that you don't hear people talking about when it comes to autoimmune disease. Autoimmune disease, and it really any immune health issue, but especially autoimmune diseases, are the way the body reacts to small pieces of food that are getting in through the digestive system. These small pieces of food are getting into the, into the blood through the digestive system, in, in, at least partially because they're not being digested. These small pieces of food are protein-based. They're called peptides. And when they get into the blood because they're not being digested properly or broken down properly, the body reacts to them. When the body reacts to peptides, your thyroid or your pancreas or other uh, internal organs can be collateral damage. This is what autoimmunity is, really. It's the immune system trying to attack something and your, your own system becomes collateral damage. That tells you that helping the body process these small pieces of food can be very helpful for autoimmunity. It can protect you, it can prevent the uh, entrance of these small pieces of food into the blood inappropriately. You eat a hamburger, say, you eat a, a steak, or you eat some protein, it goes into your body, it goes into your digestive system, it goes into uh, your stomach and then into your intestine, and what's supposed to happen is enzymes are supposed to break that protein up into its components, which are called amino acids. Under 
a deficiency state, if you're in an uh, enzyme deficiency state, if you're not making enough digestive enzymes, which is very common, that protein does not get broken up efficiently. It forms, instead of amino acids, it forms long chain or, or short chains of amino acids. Instead of single little amino acids, it forms something called peptides. So you eat your hamburger, what's supposed to happen is that hamburger is supposed to get broken up into its amino acids, but if you don't have enough digestive enzymes, the hamburger doesn't get broken up into little tiny amino acids, it gets broken up into chunks, which are called peptides. Now, if you have a digest, if you have a, a problem with your enterocytes because you haven't been getting your nutritional supplements, you've been eating the wrong kinds of food, what ends up happening is these peptides go into the blood through these holes in the digestive tract, that's called leaky gut syndrome, and now you have these peptides floating around in the blood. That's not supposed to happen. Peptides tell the immune system that there's an emergency. There's an enemy that has entered into the system. The immune system then attacks these peptides, and your thyroid or other organs can become collateral damage. This is why digestive enzymes can be your best friend when it comes to taking care of eczema or comes to taking care of any immune problems, especially autoimmune disease. You don't believe me? Try it. In fact, if you don't want to... If you don't want to go out and buy digestive enzymes, you really should. But if you don't want to go out and buy digestive enzymes, you just want to check to see if there's a digestive link to your eczema or to your autoimmune disease or to your multiple sclerosis, do this, okay? Stop eating for two days. Fast for two days. Oh, I can't fast. Yes, you can. It'll feel better when you fast. Notice what happens to your symptoms, your multiple sclerosis symptoms, your myasthenia gravis symptoms, your skin symptoms, if it's an uh, immune condition. Notice what happens to your immune, immune uh, symptoms when you stop eating, and I will guarantee you, you will notice that you're feeling better, sometimes a lot better. And what does that tell you? That tells you that you got a food problem or a digestive problem. Just test it out yourself. I don't want you to believe me. I don't want you to believe anybody. You know, I wasn't a big Ronald Reagan fan, but I loved it when he said, trust yet verify. You don't want to believe what I'm telling you. You want to keep an open mind, and then you go on, uh, want to go out and do your own research. Stop eating for two days. Watch what happens to your multiple sclerosis symptoms. Watch what happens to your eczema symptoms. Watch what happens to any autoimmune or immune disease symptoms. And then give me a call on the bright side and tell me what happened. 855-660-4261 is our number. We'll be back with your phone calls right after this. Hi, I'm Dr. Joel Wallach, veterinarian and naturopathic physician. The Dead Doctors Don't Lie guy with an important message. Take charge of your health. Do not continue to blindly follow the system that has failed us all. I appreciate GCN listeners because you're open-minded and intelligent. If our system is so great, why is it that the United States, the USA, ranks nearly 60th worldwide in longevity and number one in obesity? All the while, we spend more money than all the other countries combined annually on unnecessary health care procedures and toxic drugs. It doesn't take much to get on track, not with the government government or pharmaceutical companies, but rather you in control of your own health with a basic understanding of nutrition and supplementation. FDI Longevity has the finest quality health, sports, and energy supplements available. GCN listeners are invited to join our team of people who want to stay healthy well into old age. We are currently looking for specialists to represent FDI Longevity and save America. To buy products at wholesale prices or join our business team, go to GCNteam.com. That's GCNteam.com. Support GCN. Get healthy. If you owe the IRS back taxes, listen carefully. Sweeping changes to IRS policies will help more people than ever eliminate their tax debts once and for all. And now I can help you reduce or eliminate your tax debts and end your tax nightmare. Hi, I'm Dan Pilla. I've helped thousands of people reduce and eliminate tax debts they couldn't pay. And after more than 30 years of experience dealing with the IRS, I can tell you there's no such thing as a hopeless tax case. And with the IRS's new policies, it's easier than ever to put your tax debt behind you once and for all. Call now at 800-346-6829 to learn how I can help you. You know your IRS debt will not go away by itself, but you don't have to live in fear anymore. Call 800-346-6829. Learn how I can help you eliminate wage and bank levies, release tax liens, and negotiate a settlement with the IRS that will put your tax nightmare behind you forever. Call 800-34-NO-TAX or go to TaxHelpOnline.com. That's TaxHelpOnline.com.
Hello, I'm Steve Shank. Everybody's heard the statement that what you don't know can't hurt you. But truth is, what you don't know is the only thing that can hurt you. For example, you might not know how our country's wars can hurt you. Japanese radiation and the Gulf oil spill are destroying your seafood. People don't understand how America's 50-year worst drought is hurting them. Our natural disaster experience has proven relief organizations can't take care of the victims. And there's the huge question of how the government will feed all the people that it's promised to feed with no food. What if we made the whole country into one big neighborhood where we take care of each other by taking care of ourselves? Here's the plan. For every new EPAC 60-day food supply that you order, eFoods Direct will send a 7-day food supply to each of two families in your name, free of charge. Go to eFoodsDirect.com or call 800-876-0871. 800-876-0871. eFoodsDirect.com. Every day, more and more people are feeling better than they've felt in years by going gluten-free. Now it's your chance to learn how it can change your life. The third annual Gluten-Free Living Now Expo comes to the fountains in Carmel, Indiana, Saturday, October 5th from 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. Discover the world of gluten-free living with 100 vendors showcasing and selling the latest gluten-free products. Get vital information with lectures on celiac disease, gluten sensitivity, and the gluten-free diet. And with the gluten-free cooking and baking, demos. You'll learn gluten-free can still be delicious. There's a Kids Corner sponsored by Shaw, and there's even a gluten-free beer and alcohol garden. The Gluten-Free Living Now Expo. It's everything you need to know about being gluten-free. Saturday, October 5th at the Fountains in Carmel, Indiana. Admission is free for kids 12 and under, and just $10 for adults. For more, visit glutenfreelivingnow.org and follow us on Facebook or Twitter. Sponsored by Kroger, Nature's Farm, Lutino, Hooties, Living Without Magazine, and Longevity. America's number one source for independent talk radio for over a decade. We are the GCN Radio Network. Well, this article from Nutra Ingredients. NutraIngredients-USA.com. This is a nutritional industry journal. Headline, Beyond the Gym is Satiety, the Next Frontier for Protein. Satiety means satisfaction. How many times have you heard me say that protein induces satisfaction? Protein induces satiety. You know, one of the things you're going to find by listening to this program, listening to the bright side, is you're going to be months and years ahead of the mainstream wisdom, the mainstream uh, mainstream understandings about health and nutrition. I've been talking about satisfaction and satiety and, and eating protein to induce satiety, induce satisfaction, and lose weight for years. And now finally, the marketplace has caught up. This is an interesting article. I think I'll, I'll write a blog post on this. Beyond the gym, is satiety the next frontier for protein? Uh, check out this quote from uh, Professor Heather Lighty from the University of Missouri. Eating a protein-rich breakfast impacts the drive to eat later in the day. When people are more likely to consume high-fat or high-sugar snacks, these data suggest that eating a high-protein-rich breakfast is a strategy to prevent overeating. Duh! Hello! I've been saying this for years. If you eat more protein, you will lose weight. If you eat more fat, you will lose weight. Isn't that interesting? Eat fat, lose weight. Eat protein, lose weight. I call it the modified ketogenic or the modified, uh, modified ketogenic diet. That is, more protein, more fat, less carbohydrates, lose weight, feel better. And oh, by the way, if you skip breakfast, you'll probably eat less too. If you're going to eat breakfast, make sure it's a, if you want to lose weight anyway, if you're going to eat breakfast, make sure it's a hard-boiled egg or, or some kind of egg or whey protein or a smoothie and go easy on the toast and the potatoes. All right, 855-660-4261, Gary in New York. Thanks for holding. What's up, buddy? Welcome to the Bright Side. How you doing, Mr. Fuchs? Doing good. What's cooking? God, God bless you. I appreciate all the knowledge you supply me with. Um, Thank you, man. Three, I appreciate quick, it. three quick questions for you. Yeah. There's a lot of conflicting arguments about the ingredients in the vitamin B. You know, you refer to them as like a pack of wolves. Is it true that if it's a synthetic form of any one of the vitamin Bs that it's not as beneficial as the food-based vitamin B? Well, that's a great question. I, I never called it a pack of wolves, but that's kind of cool. I like that. 
I think you made that up, but I'm, I'm going to. I might want to steal that. I thought you referred to it a couple. They're days all together. Ago. They kind of yeah. exist together in nature. Yeah, that's true. But I never called it a pack of wolves. But I like that. Okay. I like okay. it. No, that's good. I, I can work with that. They exist in nature together, and that's why even though each individual B vitamin has medicinal and therapeutic properties. If you're going to take one, you want to take them with the entire complex. What will end up happening is as you excrete, say you take niacin or something for your uh, cholesterol, and niacin is amazing for cholesterol. As your body excretes the niacin, it's going to pull out the B1 and the B2 and the B5 and the B6 and the B12, and you may end up deficient in these other vitamins if you're not supplementing with them. So you want to supplement with the entire complex so when your body excretes them, you've got the other, your other vitamins associate, you've got enough other vitamins going on, so when it excretes them, you're not going to run deficient. That makes sense. I feel like I kind yeah, of messed so, that up. So in other words, my, I guess my question is, does it matter if it's a synthetic form? Well, yeah, let me talk about that. That's a very important question, actually. See, vitamins, we have a misunderstanding about vitamins. Vitamins are incredibly difficult to manufacture. They're incredibly difficult. They require huge factories to make. Just something as simple as thiamine and vitamin B1 requires mega industrial complexes to manufacture synthetically. Plants can do it in a, 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 t a tiny square centimeter or a tiny square millimeter, but what a plant does in a tiny square millimeter requires a huge factory to produce. So we really shouldn't be have uh, to get make vitamins or to use vitamins synthetically is not a good thing. But the problem is, is that because of how badly we've abused the soils, how badly we've abused the environment, we now have plants that are deficient in these nutrients. So we've forced ourselves to use these synthetic vitamins. So all vitamins, unless they're going to be whole food vitamins, and we talked about how, how, how difficult it is to get quantities of vitamins in whole foods, all vitamins are going to be synthetic. That's, that's just the nature of it. The, but it's not necessarily a bad thing because by the time that B vitamin makes it through your digestive tract and goes into your intestine and gets absorbed into cells, the body doesn't know if that B1 came from a factory or if that B1 came from a plant. By the time it's been broken down, it's just thiamine. It's just B1. Yes, if it's synthetic, it's not going to have the cofactors. That's true. The cofactors are very important, and that's why I always say you want to make sure that your diet is correct. But once the thiamine or the riboflavin or the niacin or the uh, 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 pantothenic acid or whatever it is, once it's gotten through the digestive tract once, or through the stomach and once it enters into the intestine and once it gets absorbed into the intestinal cells and once it goes from the intestinal cells into the blood, it's just thiamine. And whether it came from China or India or, or a, a rutabaga or a, 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 an apple, it doesn't matter. It's just thiamine. Where it becomes important is in the cofactors that help the body absorb and utilize that thiamine. And yes, you're, it's true that a synthetic vitamin is not going to give you those cofactors, and that's why you always want to make sure that the core of your nutrition is food and that you use supplements as supplements. They right. supplement the diet. Does that make sense? So important. I get these questions all the time. We're yeah. supplementing. We're filling in the blanks. We're completing our nutritional needs by supplementation. Right. Does that answer your question, bro? Yep. And then just one quick question about uh, I'm a big believer in, in taking vitamin K2. Yes, sir. So I, I do, too. I, I, I take uh, vitamin K2 as M4. And I know okay. that M4. I know you're going to get into this. I'm going to get into it tomorrow, M M4 and M7, MK4. I think it's M, M, M4 yeah, well, and M7, right. Yeah, well, yeah. M7 is the synthetic form of... No, M4, M4 is kind of is one of the synthetic forms. M7 is not. M4 okay. is used synthetically, but we'll talk about that tomorrow. You want so M7 if, is the best form. Okay, so if I'm taking... Because I take um, this product from now, so the vitamin K2. Is I it M7? Take, uh, yeah, I think so. It's M7. Okay. Um, I take 500 MCGs. Now, you said... 5,000 MCGs is where you want to be. 500 yeah. MCGs is a little bit low. But it doesn't... I mean, there's no real way to know. But I would... I Personally, I do... I do about 20... There's no toxicity to this stuff. I do about 20,000 right. MCG a day, and I skip days here and there. And uh, Vitamin K is fat-soluble, so you can skip days here and there. Uh, but I would err on the side of taking more than taking less. And 500 so is... Besides taking it in a supplement form, and I know you said you're going to get into it tomorrow, Oops. I can't, I, I can't find anything more than a hundred micrograms of, of a vitamin K supplement. 
hang tight because we'll tell you i'll tell you what i do tomorrow there's a 5000 mcg supplement that i take uh, and i forgot the name of the company that makes it but i'll talk about okay. that tomorrow okay gary thanks mr fuchs thanks buddy have a beautiful day all right uh let's see eric what's up eric in pennsylvania welcome to the bright side hey man how are you greetings what's cooking all right uh just wanted to chime in on uh on the chelation therapy um, yes sir uh, from from my research, I'm I'm a pretty uh, interested in uh, nutrition as well, so I, I do a lot of research myself. So I don't know if you want to investigate. And uh, uh, so as far as chelation therapy, it's a little bit harsh, and a lot of uh, uh, naturopaths and a lot of uh, MDs and doctors actually recommend a more uh, gentle approach. And, like uh, nutritional, you talking about? Yeah, uh, the the next best thing, or actually even better, uh, is therapeptase in uh, eighty thousand uh, in, uh, international units. Um, as a chelating agent, therapeptase as a chelating agent. Correct. And and you think EDTA? Are you saying as opposed to EDTA? Yes. So um, when you say harsh, you're talking about EDTA chelation. You're not talking about chelation therapy itself. Uh, the inter intravenous, we're talking about, I, I thought you were talking about the intravenous. Case. Yes, intravenous yeah. EDTA. What, what are you saying is yeah, harsh? That's, that's very harsh compared to uh, the more recommended um, gentler uh, approach, he, he, such as here's uh, the pro- serapeptase you, this, number. Well, here's the problem with serapeptase, and serapeptase is an oral chelation. And here's the problem with oral chelation, just the way I see it. You don't know what the chelation will attract, will, will uh, magnetically attract all minerals. Not just, not no, just no, count. No, serpentase doesn't, doesn't, the serpentase has nothing to do with minerals. It clears, it cleans out the arteries, the plaques, it cleans out the fibrin. Cleans That's out the enzymatic of... activity. That's how it works as an enzyme, but you're saying it's a chelation, it has a chelation property as well? Chelation is different from enzymatic activity. Uh, well, you were talking about mainly, I thought you were mainly talking about uh, the, the plaques build up in, uh, in the arteries for people. Oh, I see what you're saying. No, I was talking about attracting calcium away so the plaques don't form. I wasn't talking about breaking up plaques. Serapeptase as an enzyme works to break up fiber, uh, fibers, protein fibers. All proteolytic enzymes will do that. But as a chelating agent, and I have to do some research on serapeptase as a chelating agent because I know it does, it has been used for chelation. Hey, can I get you to call back tomorrow? Because we're out of time. Yeah, sure. Absolutely. Give us a call back tomorrow. We'll, we'll continue this discussion, and then we'll finish up on vitamin K and ways you can get it in your diet. That's all the time we have for today, guys. I'm Pharmacist Ben. We'll be back at you tomorrow with more good health information. Have a wonderful, beautiful, awesome day. We'll talk to you later. Bye. Bye. What if it happened, the lights go out, and the power doesn't come back? Could you provide your family with the basic necessities of life? We can teach you how at the Sustainable Preparedness Expo. This Sunday, September 22nd, at the Spokane County Fair and Expo Center. Learn about growing all your own food, herbal medicine, emergency medical and dental techniques, water well hand pumps, seed saving, emergency radio communication for beginners, and other life-saving information to provide you with the knowledge to survive. In the direst of situations, there's a wide variety of vendors offering the latest preparedness products and services. Plus, visit the Longevity booth. The Sustainable Preparedness Expo is an event the entire family will enjoy. For tickets and registration info, go to SustainablePreparedness.com. Enter promo code GCN to save $3 on tickets. Don't wait to be a victim. Plan ahead with the Sustainable Preparedness Expo. This Sunday, September 22nd at the Spokane County Fair and Expo Center. American gardeners and fellow patriots, make the right choice with your money, time, and your family food supply. Choose 100% pure heirloom seeds in the Survival Seed Vault from MyPatriotSupply.com. Why spend more? The Survival Seed Vault from MyPatriotSupply.com is only $37.95 and includes 20 varieties of pure, hardy, easy-to-grow heirloom seeds. Yes, only $37.95. That's 70% less than our competitors. You could buy three Survival Seed Vaults for less than one of theirs. The Survival Seed Vault from MyPatriotSupply.com. 
Farm.com includes detailed planting and seed saving instructions and ships same day. Plus, all orders over $49 ship free. MyPatriotSupply.com is American owned by patriots like you, passionate about freedom and preparedness. Call now, 866-229-0927. That's 866-229-0927. Or discover more emergency preparedness items when you order at MyPatriotSupply.com. Choose the original. Choose the Survival Seed Vault at MyPatriotSupply.com. 